I have to say my favorite driver is every driver that comes to Pikes Peak to race. I feel it takes a great amount of courage to take on this mountain. I feel it's a good way to get rid of your fear. It's a way to come to the summit of the most beautiful place in the world. Yeah, the weather is something you want to always watch. These clouds aren't troublesome at all. I'm just kind of watching them build. Typically, our storms will build up here around uh, 1.30, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Well, it's really a big unknown right now how we're going to do. It's a standard production SUV, and uh, the only modifications is the roll cage for safety. So um, if I can get under 13 minutes, I think I'd be really happy. car was up to 130 miles an hour. I just sliced through the trees like, like a knife. This cutter is capable of cutting through the roll bar in a matter of minutes. The case of Paul Dahlenbach's crash, um, by the time we arrived on the scene uh, and had him uh, out of the vehicle was less than five minutes. Yeah, last year was uh, pretty scary. I Just off the start line, uh, my throttle stuck in, in fifth gear at 135 miles per hour. Really looking forward to going up there this time for the first time since that accident and getting past that turn two where it all happened. This is a spot where Paul Dahlenbeck left the race course about 1,300 feet after the starting line. Went through here, knocked down eight or nine trees before he landed another 60, 80 feet behind me. Engineer's Corner. We've had multiple cars off here every year. Um, we've had three cars at once. We've had a truck go 45 feet in there and land up in a tree that was 35 feet high. We had to cut the tree down at the end of the day. How am I doing? This is the middle of the fourth leg. We had a car go off here last year. He ended up 350 feet right down there. Anybody else would have needed a parachute. It was unbelievable. The car was wonderful. Plenty of power up here. Um, you know, in this altitude, you lose you lose about 40% of your power, but it didn't feel like it. It just pulled all the way up. I had plenty of it. I'm pretty happy with that run. 